Um, speaking of nonce behavior, this is this is a famous guy, Ryan Dawson. Um, he was a gay guy that was really popular, I think, on YouTube for a while. And then he he's kind of fallen off, but he's still like really rich and famous, and he keeps doing the same shit. Well, he and his gay boyfriend have bought children. And here he here they are. They just picked him up out of the uh, out of the factory, the baby factory, and they're wheeling him wheeling him home. Brand new babies they just paid for. Skin on skin contact, exactly what you want to see there. Uh, this is also. They're just pointing this out because it's like he's sleeping like it was so hard on him. It was so hard for Shane Dawson to watch this woman that he paid give birth. And he's, he's so tuckered out. He's sleeping right next to his baby that he paid for. It. He needs a recovery. He needs a hot cocoa and a foot rub from all that birth giving that he watched happen. <laughs> um. Oh yeah, he also had Shane Dawson also had his own like Milo Milo moment where he said, "I guess it depends on the child or something." I wish I remembered the specifics for this, but it was like, um, I want to say that he had an incident. What what happened? I'm trying to remember. It's on the tip of my tongue. Shane Dawson had an incident where he justified like boy love or something and it was like a big deal and he, he got canceled for it he interviewed kiro the wolf really <laughs> i didn't know that he masturbated on a cat is that this guy he openly lusted over children multiple times he said that he had searched for child pornography he literally admitted to googling child pornography and he fucked his cat and he interviewed kira wow and it, oh but I mean, you don't have to clear a background check. You have to you have to go through the most painful undertaking imaginable to adopt a child. If you are like a Catholic family in a liberal state and you're trying to adopt a child, um, it's like the most grueling thing you could possibly fucking imagine. But if you want to pay a woman to bear your 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 test to a baby, there's no, there's no checks involved at all. You just pay a woman to do it, and then bam, you bought two babies. Congratulations. It's literally just a paper contract. Amazing. We do live in a society, chat. Oh, and this guy uh flew off talking about it. These are these are real or not ironic, by the way. This is why the responsible thing to do is make sure each egg chosen for fertilization does not come from the female meat sack paid to bring the children to viability. I agree that surrogates uh, that do this are practically selling their children. Um, someone says, it's not about their biological being the mother, it's the misogyny of you calling women meat sacks. Boo hoo, I'm paying her to be the meat sack and she'll cash the check with a smile. The meat sacks ch changes aren't my problem. She'll be paid appropriately and wished well on her next next project when it's over. Oh, you know who agrees with this? Keemstar. Sneeko says this is child sex trafficking, which is very true. I don't know about the sex part, but it is definitely, it's literally, you're buying a child. Keemstar says Sneeko better have good lawyers because there's no way he actually has evidence. This literally, they literally just became parents. So Daniel Keem stepping up to the base to um to defend uh this. And by the way, you know who else might consider women meat sex and who is friends with Daniel Keem? Uh Sam Hyde here, November 20th. Just wanted to say thanks to Keemstar again for publicly giving me the boost a year ago and really essentially going out on a limb for me for no reason. Thank you guys and hit me up if there's anything I can do for you. Well, Sam, he might need you to put women back into meat sack back into the surrogacy chamber because they got gay youtubers with millions of dollars who are ready to buy a children that's right chat we're going back to making women sex objects thank you thank you keem thank you sam spiritual guidance for a generation um oh and where is this Sorry, my, oh, this is cute. not now. That's why it's not loading. Who's Asian? Oh, you want one wife? No, bro, you don't want an Asian. 
This is what happens when you listen to the right wing and be like, dude, no, like white women are like dogs. Yeah. You want a spicy little tanks or a chinky woman. She will cook you stir fried rice. Yeah. You will enjoy the stir fried rice. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Dolphin. Remember to like and subscribe.